lovely Fleur, Fleur, Fleur. Welcome back to a new vlog with me, Seppi, Saina and my naked bar. <laughs> Tonight we're going shopping. It's 6.30 p.m. So we're gonna go to Selfridges. Selfridges shuts at nine. Saina wants some new trainers. I don't really want anything in particular, but we'll show you guys what we're wearing when we're in the shops when we get in the car. Buongiorno. Ciao, bella. Let me take one of my shoes. <laughs> Literally, yeah, she's taking off her shoes. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Try your naked bar. Do you not like it? It's alright, it tastes like, um, it literally tastes like crushed dates. Yeah, it's meant to be like date flavor. Is it? Mm-hmm. Bottom. Kiki is who just beeped for us? I don't know, but well, me and you keep getting beeps constantly. I don't know if they're perfect. <laughs> yeah, yesterday we went to um, Tesco late at night because I really wanted Halo Top ice cream. And um, yes, she was in her PJs. I was literally in pyjama shorts. When I tell you guys, my butt was almost out and I was wearing my pink Montclair on top and I just looked stupid because I was like half ski, half, half like naked basically. And um, so I was like, no, you have to get out of the car. I don't want to go in by myself. So I didn't want to, she didn't know what I wanted I didn't as know well. What she to be wanted. fair, I didn't know what flavor I wanted either. So I went with her, and then when we were getting back in the car, some Range Rover beeps. No offense, yeah, to all my friends out there who drive Range Rovers. I don't know which one of you guys it was or if it was a random pup. So, yeah, we were confused. Who is that? I feel like he's waiting as well. He's following us. Yeah, I swear to God. What the hell? That's scary because they stopped outside a house. Do you think these Chris these lights are Christmas lights or Diwali lights? Probably Diwali. It's too early. Happy Diwali to our um All celebrators. Our Indian yeah, it's not just Indians, we celebrate it's, Diwali. Yeah. We had curry last night. Not curry, biryani, sign so of chicken biryani. I made it just for Diwali, see? You know that sign is a domestic goddess. Lol joke, she only knows how to make one dish, which is chicken biryani. That's not true. I don't see Seppi there playing any music, huh? All she ever does Sorry, I'm is just on to her message. phone. No, I'm replying to a message. For me to be able to talk to her, I have to message her. Seppi, I'm messaging you right now saying, can you please put some music on? Wait, I have to reply to this message. I swear the Mercedes turned. No. It's following us. Who is it? I don't know. I love this song, guys. Throwback from the past. You'd be lying if you said I wasn't something that you're into. Into. Don't be starting in front of your friends. Never asking me what I'm into. I replied music, baby, follow my Insta. Tell you all your two faced friends, yeah, I've been true. You'd be lying if you said I wasn't something you were into. Tell me you like me. Tell me you want me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sign is trying to pick out a scarf. This scarf. You have to give me the one that you've got. Just trying to decide. I vote pink, by the way. Obviously. Sign is reading comments on today's vlog. <laughs> Side eye. Well, thanks for all the love, everyone. <laughs> I'm so happy, I'm gonna carry on shopping. <laughs> what do you get now? Oh, uh, I got a scarf from um, Louis Vuitton. I'm just waiting for them to give it. But it's basically, the lady's gonna bring it now, but it's basically. It's one of those. Yeah. I showed you guys. Oh, we don't, they don't know what color you went for though. Yeah, the wait and see. Zippy, I thought you were helping me buy shoes. <laughs> Trainers, shit. Basically, I wanted to buy trainers. <laughs> That's so true. I wanted to buy trainers, and then Sophie's like, "Oh, I'll come and help you." So I ended up buying a scarf. And I'm still trainerless, and I'm getting these magically. All of a sudden, here's that this is the last pair, the last. But I tried to find them online. And then there might be someone waiting just behind us to purchase these if Seppi takes them off. So, so I'm she's decided that she wants to buy them. So now we're trying to decide what to eat. 
pretending I'm looking at my phone, but it's not my phone, it's Seppi's. And I'm sending pics of them. The closest was 38 and a half. Will the shoe fit, Cinderella? This is, I'm a size 13 and a half. What is that? Should that size could you actually it fits, you know? Oh my god! Let me see. Let's see it <laughs> well, then it fits. That's a look. Well, then look at how good the front of these shoes are. Fashion good. Really? Now I get up. Let me see. Let me wear the other one. They're so malus. They, you know what's good about these is you know what I mean? You can wear them with um, jeans. Very nearly to an ambush. Well, man, I love trainers, baby. I'm too hammy. She's a donor, but man, fluffy. We're just trainers. Man, you're not just a self. You're just commission, baby. Yeah, these don't suit you at all. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're not meant to tie it behind it. That's even worse. What am I meant to do? Tie it at the front. You actually do not suit these at all. Baba boots are really good. Okay, it's not. You can't. It's not really a fair test, though. Should I tell you why it's not a fair test? Because you're wearing a skirt, but yeah. still, I I'm wearing. I was wearing nothing, and those trainers look cute on me. It's because you can wear trainers with like no tights, but these are right. I could just tell they're they're too big though. No, just the style. You look so silly. <laughs> You look, wait, sideways, especially you look like an alien. <laughs> I feel like I'm shipping out. <laughs> Take me, I'm pretty. <laughs> so, damage is done. They didn't damage have the boots that we liked like for her. <laughs> they didn't have the boots that I love for her in so like her size. Easy. So we have to come back and get them. But let us know if you think they're cute in the comments. I think they're very beautiful and classic. Um, yeah, now we want to eat something. Can you stop singing? And now, yeah, we're gonna go eat something. I don't know what we're gonna eat. <laughs> but someone just said, uh, basically, <laughs> basically, since Soma's has graduated, and I love my filter, should I take the cheese? <laughs> what have you done? You've fallen from, from the elephant off. <laughs> I don't know why we zoomed in when I said that. Guys, I have such a long I hair. like your outfit today. Okay, shall I show you? Yeah, I'm wearing this. Oh, yeah. Look at that. 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 Yeah. Look from Sebi's cupboard. <laughs> Not from my cupboard, I literally bought it today from Zara, the carry-on. <laughs> didn't even make it to Sebi's cupboard. Diana's bell and my necklace. Ooh, Sebi's earrings that were in her last vlog. And I had my hair braided, but Sebi, I did it. And I was literally wearing no makeup. Guys, I've been so bad. All of this week, I woke up so late. I woke up at 8 o'clock, left the house at 8.06. I literally wore my gym jam to work. And then, yeah, but that's because I changed into change my scrubs. Yeah, I totally scrubs. forgot about it. When I finished the day and came to change back into my clothes, normal clothes, I was gonna go out. And then I read, like, go out shopping to buy some clothes. And then I realized that I'm wearing my pajamas. I couldn't leave. It's so, quite cool that you can go wearing, like, pajamas because you get changed to scrub. Yeah. So, sorry if the lighting is bad because it's night time. Um, but sina has gone back to Latvia and I thought I'd show you guys what we got because we were going to film it that evening but we ended up going to dinner and getting distracted. So obviously we want to show you guys what we got properly because you probably didn't see it whilst we were out. So I'll start off with what I got first. Sina left her shopping here because she didn't need it in Latvia. Um, so I'll show you what she got as well after. Starting with what I got from Balenciaga. I think you guys saw when I was in the store, but I um, picked out the last pair of Triple S sneakers. Um, this is the colour combination that I really wanted and everywhere I searched online they didn't have and I read online that you meant to size down. So I'm usually a size three and a half, four um in like designer trainers so i was like i definitely gonna need a three so 36 everywhere i searched my teresa like selfridges harrods the actual um 
Balenciaga website. Everywhere I was checking didn't have size threes, um, and especially in this color combination. And then when I went into the store, they had one pair um, on display of this color combination, and it was literally in my size, so I had to grab it. So these are the Balenci's, the triple S in black, white, and pink. And once I took these, they literally had no other pairs to put out on display in this color combination because it's so highly requested and sold out so on the front it says triple s and 36 which is the size and then the style is kind of like like a worn look kind of thing um i don't know what my parents will think of this i i'll like try and film their reaction to these sneakers but um yeah my my parents love christian louboutins they think that they're very beautiful and like so pretty my mum likes my designer trainers but i don't think my dad loves them my dad loves me in heels he thinks i look best when i'm in heels so <laughs> i'll film his reaction to this but um yeah I, I love these and i think that they're so pretty and i've already styled them so check out my instagram persian bunny and you'll see how i've styled them um, or how I'm going to style them in the future, but I absolutely love them. I think they're so pretty. Also, they're quite comfortable, but they're quite heavy. So I'm just gonna put it out there. Like, um, if it's your first pair, I don't recommend getting the Triple S sneakers as your first pair of design trainers, just because I do feel like they're quite pricey. They were 650 pounds, I think. And um, I do feel like they're like a, like it's like a trend basically so it, it, it's probably like in a in a year and a half two years time you're not going to want to wear these anymore because there's going to be a new trendy sneaker so i don't really recommend getting these if it's your first pair but all my other pairs i have four other pairs of designer trainers and they're all classics so and i really wanted another white pair so i feel like these were just the perfect like new chunky sneaker style shoe and in a couple years time they'll probably be dirty and can't use them anyway so i'm gonna make the most of them in in the next couple years but yeah i've had my valentino trainers um this christmas is going to be two years and they are classic like they're still so like they still sell them in store they're still so beautiful i love them they're they're i re really recommend them the chanel ones are so beautiful they're another classic so yeah don't start with these if you're looking to start with a pair unless you really love them obviously next i'm going to show you what sign i got from louis vuitton um so she got this winter scarf so pretty i'll show you what it looks like around my neck it's so pretty and it's got it's black and then it's got like a glittery lv print design on it and this looks so nice with all of our like coats and stuff so she could just literally throw it on any coat that she wants and this color goes with a lot more clothes um than the other color options they had available so they have it in like gray white etc but i feel like this color matches a lot more things and it matches um, a pair of boots that she got that I'm going to show you guys now. So you guys saw that she wanted the Louis Vuitton trainers or boots and um, they didn't have the boots in her size and the trainers looked gross on her. Um, so we ended up going to Stuart Weitzman after. She wants some nice wintry classic boots. So I'll show you what's in the first one. She got the classic Highland boots. So this one is like a really light grey and it's really high like above the knee with a tie at the top and I think that they are so beautiful she's going to be able to style these with uh, dresses and um, with jeans and just with anything really and it looks like it's going to be really comfortable to walk in she has loads of street whites with boots and she says they're the most comfortable and she doesn't have any of this colour so I feel like very beautiful another pair of highland boots but this one is in like a teal it's like a bluish gray like in this light it looks it looks gray but like i feel like it's also like a blue i don't know let me know what you guys think but um yeah so it's literally the same thing over the knee but in a different color and i'm literally making such a mess of this um yeah so i feel like it's really pretty again same thing she can wear with dresses or um, with jeans. I feel like this one's probably better to wear with jeans, but she's gonna need some really good sprays to spray on top of these. So if you guys know any good suede protectants, let us know in the comments because 
we don't want them to get ruined so that is the end of the haul and everything that we got it's funny because we sat out saying i don't want i didn't really want anything sina wanted designer trainers i ended up with the designer trainers and sina didn't get any trainers and ended up with a whole bunch of other things but that's always the case right it's always what happens um especially with us i don't mind i don't know about the rest of you but that's always the case with me that is the end of this haul i hope that you guys enjoy enjoyed this mini vlog haul thing where we not only show you like what we got but also the fun shopping process of it and just us mucking around um make sure that you leave us a comment i love reading comments um i'm trying my best to reply to all of them and i think i've replied to all of you guys i i definitely spend about um 45 minutes a day replying to comments so that should get to most of you and when you guys send me messages like i've even got like instagram dms and stuff ugh, you make my day i love you guys so so much and um yeah don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more hauls i'm pr planning to film a zara haul um probably t in a couple of days time so it should be up later this week for you guys um of winter pieces so i might include some h&m stuff as well but basically everything's going to be under 30 pounds um because i want it to be more of an affordable haul i know this one's more of a luxury haul um but yeah i want to film an affordable one so make sure you subscribe for that if you want to check out my socials i'll have them linked down below as per usual but i'll write them across the screen too my instagram is persian bunny my twitter is the persian bunny and my snapchat is seppi samai i love you guys so 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 much and thank you guys for watching and i'll see you next time bye